Hello everyone, I am Prem Kumar. Welcome to Math J Academy. Today I am going to discuss with you how to find the number of solutions of fractional pot functions and greatest integer functions related questions. Okay, you can see the given question is 4 times fractional pot functions equal to x plus greatest integer functions. You need to draw the graph of this. First you have to simplify this. So for that you know the greatest integer function definition. When x is 0 to 1 is 0. When x is 1 to 2 is 1. When x is minus 1 to 0 it will be minus 1. So you already know this. Okay. Then how to define the fractional pot function x minus greatest integer function. Then how to write x here greatest integer function plus fractional pot function. Therefore any real number you can write as sum of the fractional pot function and greatest integer functions you can write. Now you can see in the left side you can see replace fractional pot function definition x minus greatest integer function you can simplify this you will get 3x by 5 is equal to greatest integer function you can draw this graph separately so you can see the greatest integer function you know how to draw the graph and you know the left side will be 3 by 5 x is a straight line is passing through the origin you can see the graph of this where these two graphs are intersecting you can see y is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1 understood so from this so what we conclude so the y here is 0 means the greatest integer function is 0 y is equal to 1 means the greatest integer function is equal to 1 but you know that greatest integer function is equal to 3 by 5 x then we need x only how to write 5 by 3 by 5 by 3 by greatest integer function what are the greatest integer functions we got it here 0 and 1 right if greatest integer function is 0, x is equal to 0. When greatest integer function is equal to 1, x is equal to 5 by 3. You can see the graph 0 and 5 by 3 is the solutions. Right? So, I hope everyone understood this. These two solutions are possible. If you want to verify through the algebraically, you can see using the fractional part functions. The range of fractional part function is 0 to 1. You can apply, you can find the greatest integer function is 0 and 1. And then you need x value. x you can write as greatest integer function plus fractional part function. You have to replace fractional part function in terms of greatest integer functions. You can substitute it here. You can find the same solution. x is equal to 0 and x equal to 5 by 3. I hope everyone understood. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you everyone.